We have a package of bills in front of us supported by a bipartisan group of legislators, supported by the Attorney General, that's, that's going to give him the tools to prosecute the waste, fraud, and abuse in the Medicaid system. Um, I'm proud to be a part of these bills, and, and I think that as we move forward, we can, we can move these through fast and show the, the, the taxpayers that we are pushing good government. Uh, taxpayer resources are finite, and when it comes to Medicaid dollars, we must ensure those resources are used efficiently and effectively. <clears throat> A recent U.S. Inspector General report showed that DHS paid $49 million, $49 million in taxpayer funds for Provider Preventable Conditions, PPCs. So federal law pro prohibits provi Provider Preventable Conditions from Medicaid reimbursement. So we're trying to attack this in, in the simplest terms to give those tools, to give those necessary measures that we can do to, to attack the $49 million in waste just on this bill. So PPCs are typically surgical procedures that are done on the wrong person or even possibly the wrong body part. So taxpayers should not and legally are not responsible to pay for wrongly, wrongfully performed surgery. In order to prevent PBC, PPCs, our proposal would require DHS, would, would require service providers under Medicaid to enter, enter into a contract with DHS and allow the Commonwealth to recoup money wrongly spent on a PPC. Failure to do so would, re would result in a fine, which would be up to 5% of the total amount of PPC paid to the provider. <clears throat> Any provider under Medicaid failing to keep proper documentation ensure that has not been a provider preventable condition would face fines ranging anywhere from a half a percent to 5% of their total Medicaid cl claims. So we're talking about some serious money now. While these provisions are punitive in nature, they will serve to deter providers for billing unnecessary Medicaid for egregious mistakes such as operating on the wrong person. So I look forward to uh, being part of this group of bills and uh, I thank everybody for their part.